What's up guys, Rand Razor here with another tech video for you guys today. And today we bring us a quick in-depth review of the Inditech portable hard drive enclosure. So this hard drive comes in your standard uh, cardboard packaging here. It has also USB 3.0 um, technology built in, so you should get really fast transfer speeds for those of you who like to use this as a portable hard drive. So the enclosure itself here, a quick return exchange guide, a manual. There's a foam sticker here for uh, thinner hard drives that you may put once you put in here. So here's the uh, hard drive enclosure itself. It's pretty standard plastic enclosure and a tech logo on the top here. You also have a light on the bottom here when you plug it in to show that it is powered. An on and off switch on the bottom and as well as the uh, USB 3.0 uh, connector port. This doesn't require any external uh, power. Everything is powered through the USB cable. To pop this open, it's very simple. You just slide it upwards and it just comes out like so. As you guys can see, I do have an SSD drive already installed in here. This particular SSD drive, and you can also put a standard hard drive in here as well, is a 120 gigabyte uh, SSD drive from my older 15 inch MacBook Pro. Since I picked up the Retina model, obviously you can't really use this since Apple doesn't uh, have standard SSD drives of this size in the Retina model since they're too thin. Uh, but it's kind of nice that I can actually reuse this as a portable hard drive. And basically the main point I want to get out of this video is just that if for those who have old laptops lying around, generally they have like a 250 or 500 gigabyte hard drive in them. It's actually kind of neat that you can pick up one of these for less than around $20. I'll post the actual price in the video here and reuse them as a portable hard drive. So we have an extra hard drive with 500 or 700 gigabytes or even a terabyte of space that you could reuse and store movies or files or use it to back up your computer, which I think is really useful and kind of recycles your old computer or at least the hard drive part of it. Installing these is very easy as well. You just take your hard drive here. There's two connector ports on the bottom. So make sure they match and line up with the hard drive connectors and slide it into place. Once you have that done, grab the top lid here, put it back on, and you're pretty much ready to go. Using it is very simple as well. Just flick on the on switch, plug it in. Blue light will shine, let you know that there's power going through, and you're pretty much ready to go. If for some reason the hard drive isn't compatible with your computer, you can always reformat it. Just uh, for Macs, go to Disk Utility and you can reformat it to whatever format the uh, standard um, Macs uh, take. In terms of cons or things I don't like about the hard drive enclosure, overall there really isn't anything bad to say about it. It's affordable, it's a simple and easy to use design and comes with everything you need. So here's a quick demonstration of transferring a big video file such as this Bose one here I made a video of the past. It's uh, 1.5 gigabytes. It'll be transferring over USB 3.0 plus the SSD drive uh, that's in the enclosure. So that should speed things up. We'll drag it to the uh, hard drive here. Let's see how long it'll take. So it says it's gonna take about a minute, which I'd say it's pretty quick, probably less than that. It's already about 200 and almost 300 megabytes right now. Still going. Um, obviously I'm not gonna bore you guys with this, but nonetheless transferring one and a half gigabytes of data uh, onto your hard drive this quick, I'd say it's pretty good. And the blue LED light also flashes to let you know that you are currently transferring data into the hard drive, so you probably shouldn't unplug it right away. In conclusion guys, I definitely recommend the Inatech hard drive enclosure. It's affordable, easy to use, easy to install, and a great way to reuse old hard drives. Anyway, thanks for watching guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and that's my quick in-depth review of the Inatech hard drive enclosure with USB 3.0 technology. As always, I'd like to thank Inatech for shooting this out for review. Hit that like button. As always, it helps me out and I'll see you all next video.